for you, like the question is, are the timestamps reliable? And the answer is, are they reliable down to the second? No, but are they reliable to the hour or to the day? Then, then yes, definitely to the day, definitely not to the second. And then it's kind of probabilistic in between. It's kind of like you're 80% confident of the hour or something like that. Because that could be relevant to like some kind of major breaking news event where it's like a minute by minute um, information is changing. Yeah, exactly. Now you have the other problem with time stamping though, is that time stamping tells you that this is no newer than when it was time stamped, right? But it could be a lot older. Like maybe someone waits five years and then they time stamp it. So time stamping doesn't tell you how, um, yeah, it doesn't tell you how, how new something is. It just tells you it's newer than a certain date. Yeah, Does but I guess I'm sense? assuming if it's time stamped once, then every subsequent time stamp you'll do. Yeah, exactly. So once you time stamp time something, stamp you know time. that it wasn't created after that time stamp. Like if I take a picture and I timestamp it, you know that it wasn't that it was created five days later and I sometimes somehow like back, back time the timestamp on it, right? But it still could be a hundred year old picture that I'm timestamping now, right? So usually if you wanna like truly timestamp, you want something in both directions. So you wanna say it's no newer than this and it's no older than this, right? So blockchain are really good for the one kind of bound and you can do the other kind of bound. So this is like, you know, like in movies where they, there's the ransom picture and they're like, hold up a copy of today's newspaper or whatever. That tells you that that the uh, picture is no uh, older than, than whenever that newspaper came into existence. So we have this concept, we call them beacons, which are like random numbers. And you can actually use blockchains to generate them and, or you could use stock data or something like that. But if you timestamp something with a beacon, right? It actually says, okay, this was timestamped. It couldn't have been timestamped any earlier than this because they wouldn't have known what the stock prices were on that particular day. And then the blockchain will protect it in the other direction. Oh, okay. So, so it just th includes some other piece of information that makes it so that you know that it was. Uh, okay. Yeah, that is fresh, fresh. Now, that is only of the timestamp itself. It's not necessarily of the thing being timestamped. 